Factsverse presents 15 Prehistoric Creatures That Are Still Alive Today First, help us spread the word about Factsverse by clicking that like button, and also be sure to subscribe and click the notification bell so you don't miss our future videos. Dinosaurs have been extinct for thousands, possibly millions of years. Ever since the Ice Age, these creatures have been gone. What you might not know is that there are some creatures on Earth today who actually roamed the Earth with the dinosaurs, and I have a list of 15 prehistoric creatures that are still alive today. It's pretty shocking these creatures have lasted this long. Number 1. The Gorilla Crocodiles, alligators, and caimans – they're all ancient species. You can tell just by looking at them, they kind of look like dinosaurs, don't they? There's one species of crocodile called the gorille, also known as the gavial. It looks more prehistoric than all the others. They have very long, narrow mouths that kind of look like a sword. Their teeth are really sharp, too, and menacing. The males have a large, bulbous nose at the end of their snout, which makes the male look less threatening than the females. This creature has been around for millions of years. Sadly, it is on the brink of extinction. Today, there are less than 200 gorillas that are capable of reproducing. They're listed as a critically endangered species, and they are found in the wilds of Pakistan, India, and Bangladesh. There's a breeding center at Kukrail Forest Reserve in Lucknow, India, and they've been trying to breed these creatures and send the young to zoos all over the world. The center is open to the public, allowing visitors to see one of the oldest species on the planet. Number 2 the Komodo dragon. Komodo dragons are found in Indonesia, and according to many scientists, this might not be where the creatures originally came from. Not too long ago, Komodo dragon fossils were found in eastern Australia. It's believed that the fossils that were found date back as far as 4 million years ago. These lizards are dangerous. They can weigh more than a human, and they're known to attack. Even worse, they are somewhat venomous. If you want to see a Komodo dragon up close, you can take an excursion to Komodo National Park. The park's located on a few small Indonesian islands, and there are plenty of amenities making it a comfortable place for tourists. Number 3. Shoebill Stork There's a lot of data on the shoebill stork, and it points to this bird having many different living relatives. The one thing that everybody can agree on is that it is a very old bird. The bird's beak is gray, making it look like something out of the Flintstones. Due to the habitat destruction and poachers, this bird is considered vulnerable to extinction. Fortunately, there is a protected area in the Mababa Bay wetlands in Uganda, and if you want to see this bird up close, you can take a bird spotting tour. While on the tour, you can paddle through the shallow lakes and ponds. For a minute, you might feel like you're actually in a prehistoric swamp. Everything about this bird screams millions of years old. Number 4. Bactrian Camel Most people have seen the one-humped camel that's used for transportation in the Middle East. Even before automobiles were invented, they were using them. What you might not know is that these camels evolved from the two-humped Bactrian Camel. They live in the Gobi Desert and in Mongolia. These camels look like a cross between a llama and maybe Chewbacca from Star Wars. These camels are said to have lived over 2 million years ago, and they're capable of withstanding temperatures between 0 and 100 degrees. The camel has two humps. One is used to store fat, which the camel uses to break down for energy and water. And this is what keeps the camel alive during the dry periods when they can't find food. Sadly, this camel is critically endangered. There are only an estimated 1,000 of them left in existence. Some of these camels are domesticated, and they're part of the Mongolian culture. You can even take a ride on one if you visit the annual Thousand Camels Festival every March in Mongolia. Number 5. Echidna The echidna is an adorable and bizarre-looking creature. Kind of looks like a child of a porcupine, an anteater, and a badger. This cute creature is related to the platypus, believe it or not, and it gives birth the same way. It's a mammal, but rather than giving birth, it lays eggs. It can be difficult to find one of these creatures in the wild. They are small, nocturnal, and they tend to live a solitary life far from other creatures of their kind. Scientists believe these creatures have been roaming the Earth for about 17 million years. Sadly, they are considered an endangered species today. If you want to see one of these creatures, you can visit one of the many zoos in New Zealand, Australia, and Tasmania. 
To keep them from becoming extinct, the Bonarong Wildlife Sanctuary in Hobart, Tasmania was established. The creatures in the confines of the sanctuary are protected. You can only hope that this will keep them from becoming extinct someday. Number 6. Musk Oxen The musk oxen is an amazing creature. During the fall rutting season, you can actually see them fight. They fight over control of harems. And when they fight, they run toward each other and they bash their heads together. The force is so hard it can shake the ground from a long distance away. Scientists believe that the musk oxen have been around for about 187,000 years. In the 1800s, these creatures disappeared from Alaska. In the 1930s, they came back and the population began to grow. While there are several thousand of these creatures living in Alaska now, the population has declined over the last several years. If you have your heart set on seeing a musk oxen, you need to take a trip to Nome, Alaska. It's not uncommon to see these animals wandering around the small town there. Nome is also the end of the famous Iditarod dog sled race. There are vendors in Nome who sell kiviat, which is the soft underwool that's harvested from captive or wild musk oxen. It's the warmest and finest wool in the world. It's also rarer than cashmere. Number 7. Vicuna The Vicuna is the prehistoric ancestor of the alpaca. They look very similar, but the vicuna has a very distinctive color pattern. It's white underneath and it has a brown saddle across most of its body. These animals were treasured by the Incas and they were protected too. When the Inca Empire fell apart though, these creatures came close to extinction. Thanks to the hard work of dedicated conservationists, there are hundreds of thousands in the world today. If you want to see a live vicuna, you need to take a ride down the rural roads of south-central Peru. You can also see them in the Huascaran National Park just north of Lima. The wool of the vicuna is said to be even rarer than that of the musk oxen. Number 8. Chambered Nautilus This creature lives in the deep oceans of Australia and Indonesia. If you want to see one up close, they do have them in captivity at the Monterey Bay Aquarium in California. The creature looks like the cross between an alien and a corkscrew. The fossils that have been found are from 500 million years ago. The fossils show that today's chambered nautilus looks exactly like its ancestors. Unfortunately, this creature is difficult to breed in captivity, so the population is believed to be declining. The Monterey Bay Aquarium is still trying to breed these creatures to prevent extinction. In 2018, they managed to successfully breed some of the first babies in captivity. Number 9. Babarusa This creature is similar to the pig. The only difference is that the male Babarusa has a giant tusk that grows upward through their snouts. The tusks then curve back toward their heads. In some cases, the tusks will even pierce through the creature's foreheads. There are drawings of these creatures in Indonesian caves that date back 35,000 years. If you really want to see one of these up close, you can take a trip to the Nantu Forest and Tangoko Nature Reserve in Indonesia. They offer Babarusa watching safaris. Number 10. Tapir The tapir is similar to the pig except that the tapir has a short, elephant-like proboscis which they use to bring food to their mouths. When they walk underwater, which they love to do, they use their snout as a snorkel. While these creatures do look like pigs, they're more closely related to the rhino and the horse. Fossils from this creature have been found that are at least 23 million years old, and today there are only five species left. They live in Asia, South America, and Central America. If you want to see one of these creatures, you can visit the Corcovado National Park in Costa Rica. They've also been seen in the Amazon rainforests. Number 11. White Rhinoceros This ancient rhino is a cross between the northern white rhino and the southern white rhino. Sadly, there are only a few of these creatures left all female. This means that the white rhino is going to become extinct. There are some of these rhinos living in the wild, but since they're under constant threat from poachers, they're in danger. These poachers use their horns for medicinal purposes. Conservationists have taken drastic measures to try and save the white rhino. Some of them put armed guards in the area to protect them. Others remove the horns so that the poachers will have no reason to kill them. If you really want to see a white rhino before they become extinct, you can visit Kruger National Park in South Africa. You can take a safari so that you can see one up close and personal. Number 12. 
Wobegong shark. These sharks live on the tropical Pacific Reef, and they can be very difficult to spot. They're hard to find because they use their camouflage patterns to blend in with the algae-covered rocks. They're noticeable when they start swimming and their white bellies pop out. These sharks have been around for 11 million years, and there have been a few Wobegon shark attacks reported, but fortunately there have been no fatalities. If you want to see one of these creatures without diving in the Pacific, you can see them at the Sydney Aquarium in Australia. They'll take you on a guided shark swim, in fact. You don't even need any experience. Number 13. Horseshoe Crab The horseshoe crab has been around for 445 million years. Back then, the continents hadn't even formed yet. There was just one supercontinent. These crabs can be found all along the shores, and if you want to see a horseshoe crab in person, you can see them in May in the Delaware Bay. This is the time that they head to the shore to breed. Number 14. Polar Bear Everyone knows what a polar bear is. Most people have seen them in captivity. They look like something that could have walked off of a glacier during the Ice Age. In 2010, scientists used a fossilized polar bear bone that they found in Arctic Norway. It appears this creature lived 120,000 years ago. If you want to see a polar bear in its natural habitat, you might catch a glimpse in Churchill, Manitoba in Canada. If you see one in the wild, steer clear. They are not as sweet and adorable as they look. They have been known to attack humans without provocation. If you want to see one in captivity, you can visit just about any zoo or aquarium. Number 15. Tuatara This ancient lizard lived with the dinosaurs 225 million years ago. The Tuatara that you can find today shows signs of its ancient history, too. They have a primitive third eye on the top of their heads. They're hard to see today because the eye has grown over with scales. These creatures are difficult to see in the wild, but if you're in New Zealand, you can see this lizard in the zoo or in the National Aquarium in New Zealand. Subscribe for more!